All right, Al is, wait a minute, Al is next, and he's up here. If I can learn to push the right button on this phone. Al, how are you? Hey, Mr. Ramsey, better than I deserve to be, Mr. Ramsey. Thank good, you for taking good. my call. I really appreciate it. Sure, how can I help? I, I love this show. Thank okay, you. I'll make this very brief. A couple of years ago, I co-borrowed. I know, I'm stupid. <laughs> I co-borrowed on a car. Oh, no. For my ex-girlfriend. Oh! For my oh. now. For my now ex-girlfriend. Oh, Stupid. this gets nastier. I, I by the, the every time. time you add a I'm sentence to this, it gets worse. Oh, no. This is okay, awful. It gets, it, gets, it gets worse. Okay. So she had a history of paying it late. I bailed her out a couple of times with past due payments. Now she filed for bankruptcy, Chapter 7. Yep. So who's liable for the debt? You. Stupid. Mm-hmm. Mr. Stupid. Mm-hmm. So, I did some research and I found out because I co-borrowed, not co-signed, that I have some rights to the vehicle. Mm, the, the name, your name should be on the vehicle. My name is on the vehicle. My name is on the, on the contract. My name is on the vehicle. Are you, in, are you on speaking terms with said chick? No. Oh, crap. So, I, I went to an attorney. I got a consultation with an attorney. And he just told me, listen, just go get the car. It's your car. Mm. She's not paying. She filed for Chapter 7. She filed a reaffirmation to keep the debt, and it was denied in the bankruptcy court. Yeah. I want you to get a second opinion. I'm not an attorney, but when you go just pick something up out of someone's driveway, that starts to sound like grand theft auto to me. And I really don't want you to end up with a, uh, yeah, like a felony or get shot or something like that while you're doing this. And the other thing is, if the, if she's in a bankruptcy, there's what's called a stay on all creditors, an injunction on all creditors, and you, my friend, are a creditor. And I think you picking up and repoing the car uh, might be considered an action against the bankruptcy court, and that's federal bankruptcy court. There's two possibilities here that are really negative for you. I think you need a second opinion on your attorney there like a different one because i think he's scaring the crap out of me listen i'm all about taking action and being bold and all that i'm not about going to jail and so let's just kind of balance this out Ugh, scary what's the moral of the story never co-sign and never ever ever co-sign for your girlfriend